next Tuesday. Will you please take the after pill? So you've done this before. Tyler Perry's taking you to the edge. Who is helping you and where is he? For the Oval mid-season finale. I wanted to help you to know the truth. It's Max and Bobby. I have satellite images looking everywhere. And hold on. I'm ready to tell you. Because nothing no! will ever be the same. Tyler Perry. All right, Oval fans, you just saw the preview for what apparently is supposed to be the true mid-season finale, season two, episode 13, entitled Every Weekend. So go ahead and hit the thumbs up button on the video to show you like it. Hit that subscribe button. Follow me on social media. Links are in the description below. And finally, hit the bell icon to select all. That way you don't miss out when I post new content to the channel. So... Yeah, this is going to encompass both the trailer you just saw as well as the end credit trailer that we saw during the episode last night. So Ellie has a moment where she's confronting Hunter's like, look, you don't ha you have no idea what it's like to be someone that looks like me and the things I have to deal with. Uh, no, it doesn't really matter because you try to steal his underwear and DNA. So you really have no stake in this, Ellie. Get the hell out of here. So we also have, you know... Picking up where he left off, Bobby has his gun pointed right at Donald's head. He's like, don't test me. Oh, you ain't going to do anything, son. I'm the chief of staff. So I wonder how that scene's going to play out. Uh, guys, they're cutting grass outside, so if you hear background noise, my bad. So Nancy is apparently ready to tell Richard who the father of Picky is. But the thing about it is, whatever he, uh, whatever she says apparently is so messed up that it looks like Richard is balling up his fist and then we have Nancy going, RICHARD! So, I don't know what that's all about, but think about it this way. Oh, hang on a second. They're cutting grass, cutting grass. Okay, so the title every week, and I wonder, does that have to do with, oh, the person who was Picky's father, he hooked up with me every weekend during that particular month while, or, you know, maybe they hooked up every month. I mean, every weekend while Richard was gone, I don't know. But whatever the case is, something doesn't seem too right. We also have a brief blink and you miss it scene. They don't really spend much time on this at all, but uh, Barry is in that parking lot again, meeting up with Ruth in the van. Obviously, it has to do with the money. And there's a group of Rockadushi members that come out of the van. And then there's another scene where it looks like Ruth is just standing there while, you know, they're beating the shit out of Barry in the parking lot. I'm like, well, damn. So we go over to the uh, Sam talking with Victoria, you know, getting dressed after, you know, they did what they did. And it's like, hey, promise me you take a morning after pill. Ah, so this isn't the first time you did this, huh? And you're supposed to be faithful to your wife. Look, man, I'm not playing this game. It's a little too, look, we, I was able to give Sam a benefit of the doubt before. But at this point, it's like, Sam, come, Sam, come on, man. You, no, no, you know what you did. You know what you did. Because, I mean... With her going down on him, that was one thing. I'm not saying one is, you know, hey, cheating is cheating, but at the same time, you initiated it. Yeah, she was feeling up on you. She was the one that opened her dress, but you you went to her. I mean, well, then again, when your wife is threatening you with a knife that same morning, you know, it was all out there for you. But at the same time, bro, you knew what you were doing. I mean, honestly, there are more people rooting for Victoria and Sam than Sam and Priscilla. I ain't going to lie. I can kind of see where they're coming from with that. So, could this be... I feel like, are they hinting at um, Sam being the father? But based on the preview, I don't think that's the case. I honestly don't think that's the case at all. Uh, so, after that, I think we see... It looks like Jason's walking into the room, so he must be walking in right after Sam leaves because this little creep knows what's going on. He's making a phone call. Hey, I was just trying to help you. Is he calling Priscilla? Because you know, we see Priscilla on the phone. Remember, this could be effective misdirection. He could be calling Alan. I don't know. Because speaking of Alan, it looks like there's another scene where Alan, well, Jason's in Alan's office, and Jason, it looks like he's trying to, it's like he's making a motion with his hands, like he's like using an axe, kind of like, hey, all I got to do is, on my parents and I was like get the hell out of here well we don't know it was like literally a blink and you're missing moment but whatever the case with Priscilla we have Sam in one scene looks like he's throwing something and then we got Priscilla screaming no this preview uh, full of a lot of people screaming because we also got Kyle threatening Diane with some kind of power tool on the um, elevator 
if she doesn't tell him who she's working with, which we do know she does cave in and say who she's working with because we have Kyle walking into Donald's office saying, hey, it's Max and Bobby. That's who Diane's walk, uh, working with. We got satellite images looking everywhere. So I don't know if he uh, mutilates her, you know, like cuts off her foot or her leg or something, but maybe he stops before, you know, he does anything because Diane knows he ain't playing. So either way, Kyle figures out it's Max and Bobby, which goes back to Max's rational or, um, you know, his rational thinking in last night's episode. I wouldn't trust these women because what? We got Donald walking in on Bobby and Lily. And then we got Kyle pretty much, you know, getting information out of Diane. Max should have left. So that's all we have for this particular episode trailer. Looks pretty crazy next week. We'll see how things are. Hopefully this episode is better than last night's, but that's just my opinion. And like I say, as you know, at the beginning of the video, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe. And if you want to donate to the channel, feel free to do so on PayPal or Cash App.